Dear students, welcome to IAC. Today, SSC GD Grand Test Number 65, English Explanation is here. So, let us start everyone. This is the first question. Question number 76. Select the segment of the sentence that contains a grammatical error. If there is no error, mark no error as your answer. So, let us see. He has been right on African culture for a magazine since 15th of March 2019. And I think, sir, you people all know this is so easy. Has is there, been is there. What should be there, sir? Before or what is that thing called? Verb plus ing. Yes or no? So, first of all, let us know this thing. See here. What since is there? Another one is what, sir? For yes or no? So, present perfect continuous tense. And for what present perfect continuous tense has been used, everyone? Present perfect continuous tense has been used for any action that started in the past and is still continuing. So what is the thing, sir? Present perfect continuous tense is used for those actions which are started in the past and is still continuing. And at the end, either for or since will be there as the particular thing, as a particular timing sense. Okay. So that is the thing, sir. As we know, subject plus has or have plus been plus v4 so as we got already v4 so it should be writing sir so here problem is in a sir he has been writing on that's the thing okay it's easy it's a very easy question so for question number 76 option number a is our answer next one come to 77 choose a word or phrase which is an antonym or the most opposite in meaning to the word or phrase given below and mark the correct answer so gloom is the word gloom so many meanings are there see one by one feeling sad act sullen okay sullen meaning very serious or uh, you can say sad tragic okay another meaning is also there sir that is depression okay so obviously depression whenever this thing will happen what will happen sir feeling sad those kind of moments will come so weak inform delight darkness okay so here sir delight meaning is what joy or pleasure okay and inform meaning sir weak only lacking physical strength okay lacking physical strength so in this case sir this word is gloom okay and obviously option number c delight is the answer why gloom meaning sir simply sad sullen depression and people are happy people have and are like doing happy like all kinds of things are happy joyful so there is no sadness no sullenness so in that case 77 the word is gloom option number c delight is the answer okay next one Come to 78, choose the word or phrase which is a synonym or nearest meaning to the word. So, synonym has been asked, sir. Sustain is the word. Sustain, first of all, we should know phrasal verb, keep up, okay? Prolong, maintain, hold up, another, another phrasal verb or support also, okay? So, what are the words, sir? Design, plan generate and support so sir hold up is there and hold up meaning the phrasal verb meaning is giving here support so in that case sir option number d support is the answer synonym for the word sustaining okay sustain meaning actually continuing so when you can continue somewhere when you will get support yes or no without any support you can't continue okay so that is the thing support meaning not anyone else's support your support also all the all kinds of support that can be okay and sir here generate word is there so many meanings are there supply create give okay so all these kinds of meanings are there so for question number 78 option number d support is the answer and next one Come to 79, a sentence is given with a blank, select the correct form of the phrasal verb or word for the blank given in the sentence and mark the correct answer. So, it can be a phrasal verb also, word also. So, several amendments were added to the club rules over the summer, but unfortunately, dash amendments did not promote inclusiveness. Inclusiveness meaning, sir, unity. Okay. So, all together. So, this particular, several amendments were added. Amendments meaning those new bills which will be there for betterment of anything. So, several amendments were added to the club rules. 
so in those rules in that club so many rules are there and in those rules some better amendments added okay but uh, over the summer but unfortunately the amendments did not promote inclusiveness meaning the same amendments whatever the changes ha has been taken for betterment in the club rules those rules or those new amendments is not promoting inclusiveness or unity okay so that is i think 79 option number c da is the answer why the because i am talking about the same amendments here which all which are already taken before okay so in that case 79 option number c the is our answer next one come to question number 80 everyone which of the following is the correct meaning of the idiom or phrase given below so idiom or phrase the meaning of it run of the mill is there sir ordinary okay mediocre ordinary people so in that case rare exceptional and uncommon all these three are synonymous word yes or no which is rare that is exceptional that is uncommon okay that is a thing so for 80 run of the mill meaning sir ordinary fine next one come to 81 select the segment of the sentence that contains the grammatical error if there is no error mark no error as your answer let us find out the old women kept reading pages after pages of the Gita now see very carefully pages after pages is written remember preposition is there in the middle before that after that same noun is there before that after that same noun is there then both the nouns should be written in singular only then both the nouns should be written in singular only so in that case sir page after page not pages after pages okay not doors to doors it should be door to door i think you people remembered it okay so in that case the old women kept reading uh, pages after pages should be page after page option number b there is a problem okay so this is the answer everyone so for question number 81 option number b is our answer next one come to 82 to 86 everyone let us see and one close test is there let us read in the following passage some words have been deleted fill in the blanks with the help of the alternatives given each blank has been alphabetized uh, select the most appropriate option for each blank let us see okay so i went out and bought all sorts of small gifts all sorts of like different different kinds of small gifts and then headed to the more expensive outlets dash the mail i picked up little things things i knew my mother would dash i took them home and wrapped each one dash using all kinds of packing material then i made a card for each one after doing that i dashed the gift of outside my mother's doorway and called her pretending to dash about her health she was bubbling over she told me someone had left a gift for her and signed it secret santa so let us see sir i went out and bought all sorts of small gifts and then headed to the more expensive outlets dash the mail okay in with for two in the mail okay in the mail fine so expensive outlets in the mail so what is the thing i went out and bought all sorts of small gifts and then headed to the more expensive outlets in the mail so it, that is the thing option number a is the answer okay next one so here we got in after that i picked up little things things i knew my mother would dash loving love loved lovers Ud is there na sir v1 should be there love only so i picked up those things that i knew my mother would love okay that is the thing so 83 option number b is our answer okay next one so here we got in and here we got love after that sir i took them home and wrapped wrapped meaning we are wrapping the gift so wrapped each one dash using all kinds of packing material so openly differently closely severely severely meaning badly okay and another one is also there that is a critically fine so here sir one person is is wrapping gifts for each and every one close people so in that case severely cannot be the word closely cannot be the word openly cannot be the word because he is wrapping up okay or she is wrapping up whoever he is or she is so differently 
so and wrapped each one differently using all kinds of packing material that is a thing so each one differently okay like for mother one type of packaging for father one type of packaging for sister one type of packaging like that okay so in that case sir 84 option number b is the answer okay so 84 b fine next one so here we got sir in here we got love and here we got differently okay so let us remember once again i went out and bought all sorts of small gifts and then headed to the more expensive outlets in the mail i picked up little things things i knew my mother would love i took them home and wrapped each one differently using all kinds of packing material now then i made a card for each one after doing that i dashed the gift off outside my mother's doorway now see sir i dashed the gift off forget about the gift what is there o double f off here it should be one verb okay so verb plus preposition together phrasal verb clear so let us find out sir i am dropping dropped was dropped drops so here we are talking in past tense so obviously dropped will be our answer now let us know what is the meaning of the word drop off okay put down or set down meaning if i will take this pen and put down somewhere like that or drop off somewhere like that that is a thing here okay so i made a card for each one after doing that i option number b dropped the gift off okay so my mother's doorway so doorway in the doorway i drop off or put down the gift clear everyone so that is a thing 85 option number b dropped off so drop the gift off outside my mother's doorway so 85 option number b is the answer next one come to e right now and called her pretending to dash about her health she was bubbling over she told me someone had left a gift for her and signed it secret center and select the most appropriate option to fill in the blank e so that is the thing request inquire examine withhold withhold meaning sir keep back another word is also there that is deduct okay examine meaning everybody knows inquire meaning asking a question okay so all this thing now see and called her now i dropped off the gift so first of all what i did i dropped the gift off outside my mother's doorway okay and called her pretending to inquire or asking about her health okay that is a thing now i am pretending that i am asking for her health about her health that how she is right now okay but actually I, I was pretending why i was like my mind was like that she will come out and she will see the gift and she will be surprised that is a thing so that is a thing sir she was bubbling over she told me she was bubbling over meaning filled with joy and left a gift for her and signed it at secret center that is a thing so for 86 sir option number b inquire is our answer okay that is a thing so that's all for this close test the beautiful one next one come to question number 87 everyone a sentence is given with a blank select the correct form of the phrasal verb or word for the blank given in the sentence and mark the correct answer let us see bruce is on dash who deceives others by claiming to be one of their relatives so here what is written sir deceives deceiving what is the thing sir betraying like you are saying something false word and you are making someone else to believe in that false anything that can be so in that case sir you are deceiving people okay so bruce is on dash who deceives others by claiming to be one of the relatives so wager priest idol imposter imposter meaning sir fraud people fraud or fake people okay and here wager meaning is there sir one who stake money stake or bet money i think money betting everybody knows if he will win i will give you this much if he will win i will give you this much like that so in that case sir deceiving is there now obviously imposter will be the word because deceiving meaning betraying when you can betray when you will become a fraud that is a thing imposter so bruce is an imposter okay who deceives others by claiming to be one of the relatives that is a thing 87 option number d sir clear next one 
Come to question number 88. Select the most appropriate option to substitute the underlying segment in the given sentence. If there is no need to substitute it, select no improvement. See here. Nitin is feeling sorry for his actions and trying to make amend with or for his friend. Okay. So obviously, sir, amend is not the word. Amends is the word. Option number A is the answer. Okay. Make amends. So what is the meaning? Come to this one ameliorate i will make it easy but everybody should know all the synonyms ameliorate okay meaning is what sir improve or rectify now see how why i have written improve rectify nitin is feeling sorry for his actions and trying to improve whatever he have done before with his friends the the particular relationship improvement of relationship or he wants to rectify whatever the wrongs he has done and want to make amends with his friends once again. That is the thing. So 88 option number A is the answer. Nitin is feeling sorry for his actions and trying to make amends with his friends. That is the thing sir. So for 88 option number A is the answer. Okay. Next one. Come to question number 89 everyone. Which of the followings in the correct meaning of the idiom or phrase given below? Fly off the handle. Fly off the handle meaning lose one's temper suddenly. Meaning you are becoming angry suddenly. That is a thing. Option number B. Next one. Come to 90. Select the most appropriate option to substitute the underlined segment in the given sentence. If there is no need to substitute it, select no improvement. Let us see. Ashok went running to the notice board and he was surprised by the result of the examination. So surprised with, surprised at, surprised from and no improvement. I think everybody knows after this verb called surprised, appropriate preposition, at only should be used. Any other preposition will not be entertained. So in that case, option number B is the answer, sir. Okay, so Ashok went running to the notice board and he was surprised at the result of the examination that's the thing 90 option number b is the answer clear next one come to 91 to 92 in the following questions the sentence given with a blank to be filled in with an appropriate word select the correct alternative out of the four and indicate it by selecting the appropriate option let us see he succeeded in proving his point with dash logic one by one diabolical diabolical meaning evil or devilish okay simply bad fine next one irrefutable meaning impossible to deny impossible to deny or undeniable or undeniable okay and next one sir rational meaning logical and this word analytical also almost same analytical way logical way so sir analytical and rational we can't use why because the word logic is already there and both the words are giving the sense of logic itself so in that case i can't use both c and d first of all next one diabolical word also cannot be used because he succeeded in proving his point in a if evil or devilish way people will not listen to that if one is trying to prove his point in a bad way devilish way evil way okay so that is the thing that is also cancelled now come to irrefutable meaning undeniable logic that kind of logic he has given that no one can deny and does he proved his point okay so in this case sir irrefutable is our word fine now so in that case he succeeded in proving his point with irrefutable logic 91 option number b is our answer okay so that's the thing next one Come to 92. The child looked up at her teacher, obviously afraid that she would further dash her. So options are there. Every Reverie meaning, sir, idolize or worshipping someone. Like if I will say that he is almost a reverie right now after he got a national award in somewhere, anywhere. Okay. So people started worshipping him or her or idolizing him or her. Okay. Next one, sir. Extol. Extol meaning praise or glorify. Praise or glorify. In the same way, sir, Lord meaning is also praise or glorify. Same meaning. Okay. And chastise word is there. Meaning so many meanings are there. Everybody should know. Castigate. Correcting or censoring censor severely or rebuke or rebuke 
सिंपल इन अ वेरी सिंपल वर्ड द वर्ड शुड बी सर स्कोल्डिंग दैट इज द थिंग सो द चाइल्ड लुकड अप एट हर टीचर ऑब्वियसली अफ्रीड दैट शी वुड फॉर द चेस्टाइज हर स्कोल्ड हर दैट इज अ थिंग ओके सो फॉर नाइंटी टू ऑप्शन नंबर डी इज द आंसर ओके नाउ नाउ वन थिंग सर ऑब्वियसली अफ्रीड With a freed word, Lord, an extol word cannot be there because if someone is going to praise you, if someone is going to glorify you and whatever you have done, then why you need to be afraid? When people have done something wrong, then only they are getting afraid because rebukeness will be there. People will scold. People will shout out. Okay, so that is the thing. So ninety-two option number D is the answer. Clear? Next one. Come to ninety-three to ninety-four. In these questions, out of the four alternatives, choose the one which can be substituted for the words or sentence. One word substitution is there. Let us read, sir. Express a proposition, theory, etc., in clear or definite terms. Okay. So, emancipate is our answer. Option number D. Clear, everyone. Other words are there. See, publish meaning everybody knows. Posture meaning bearing or attitude now come to proclaim sir meaning exclaim or another word is also there declare formally declare something formally publicly in front of everyone so 93 option number d enunciate is our answer next one come to 94 make something seem less important significant or trifling okay see there Uh, sup, uh, superintend optimally trivialize and dodder so see a trifling word is already there significant important less is there so less important less significant less trifling trivialize okay this is the answer sir triviality meaning something which is really unimportant fine now other words are there so superintend meaning watch and direct watch and direct meaning one person is there who is heading each and everything properly maintaining everything properly okay superintendent okay optimally optimally meaning best something of best quality and dodder dodder meaning walk and steadily walk and steadily fine all of all other things 94 our answer is option number c sir trivialize next one Come to question number ninety-five. Everyone choose a synonym of the following word. Superficial is the word. Superficial meaning unimportant or trivial. Fine. So naive, naive meaning childlike, asinine meaning stupid, foolish, air-headed. Okay, inept. meaning awkward or ill chosen awkward or ill chosen sir awkward meaning i think here everybody knows something somewhat very something happened which is not acceptable at all so at that time people are feeling awkward in front of everyone okay and cursory cursory actual meaning is hasty and another meaning is also unimportant okay so what has been asked here sir synonym so in that case both this one superficial and d cursory both are synonymous words fine next one come to 96 choose the meaning of the following idiom touch and go touch and go meaning uncertainty okay so you are touching somewhere and going you are not telling that you will take that or not you will like that or not so the shopkeeper is uncertain that he will buy that or not okay so in that case you are touching something and you are going so in that case uncertain okay so 96 option number c is the answer clear next one come to 97 choose a synonym of the following word savior is the word so obviously rescuer maiden rampant and saddle savior and rescuer both the same thing sir okay those one who is saving that same person is rescuing so in that case savior and rescuer both the same other words are there sir maiden maiden meaning first or initiative maiden speech is there na the boy is giving his maiden speech so in the meaning is what sir 
for the first time he is giving some giving some speech or delivering something that is a thing okay rampant meaning uncontrolled uncontrolled some days before rampant rainfall happened in tirupati that is a thing uncontrolled way next one sir saddle saddle meaning a seat of a bicycle a seat of a bicycle i think everybody knows a bicycle thing okay so like this it will be there and one seat yes or no so that is a thing this one this seat is called saddle okay so in this case sir 97 option number a rescuer is our answer okay so next one come to 98 choose the antonym of the given word bliss is the word bliss meaning sir extreme happiness bliss meaning is extreme happiness fine misery so obviously the misery extreme sadness tragic okay tragic extreme sadness all those meanings are there so in that case bliss and misery both are synonymous sorry antonymous very sorry antonymous okay antonym has been asked antonymous now other words are there sir tempt alluring dwindling so tempt meaning sir enticing people in trying to influence people so influencing now see there sir alluring and tempt both are synonymous okay that is the thing both are synonymous tempting alluring enticing influencing all are synonymous words come to dwindling dwindling meaning decreasing or reducing going down okay gradually obviously so that is the thing 98 bliss is extreme happiness and misery is tragic or sadness so antonym is option number a misery okay next one 99 Choose the rightly spelled word out of the given options. Let us see, sir. Catastrophe. Spelling is wrong. So, this is a spelling I think everybody knows. Catastrophe. Okay. The meaning is what, sir? Disaster. Okay. So, in that case, catastrophe spelling is wrong. Next one, foreboding. Foreboding spelling is absolutely okay, sir. Meaning is fateful or telling something in advance foretelling telling something in advance itself so we got our spelling correct spelling option number b foreboding okay in exam now don't go further you already got your answer now here consciousness everybody knows c o n s c i o u s n e w -S, s consciousness meaning awareness okay and obscene spelling is wrong o b s c e n e obscene meaning vulgar something which is which can't be seen vulgar offensive better to go for offensive okay so all these things are there so obviously 99 option number b is the answer clear next one and the last one come to number 100 choose a rightly spelled word once again distressing double s should be there sir Okay, so meaning is what concerning bad pitiful all these meanings are there defensive this one or defective also you can make your choice anyhow defensive go for s not c okay next one sir monotonous monotonous spelling is absolutely okay sir meaning is what dull boring any something which is continuously going on and on and on you will not you will not listen to that so dull boring and disinclination that is a thing sir disinclination that is a thing okay here spelling is wrong see inclination meaning towards something this is the opposite of it meaning neutral nowhere not there not here neutral okay so that is a thing neutral person so that is all so here sir 100 number option number c monotonous the meaning is dull okay something which is boring so in that case 100 number c is the answer and that's all for this set